Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome to Mario's Mansion 4. Leader, Solitaire, Developer, Deckler, and Tester Halibabaka. The previous uh, Mario's Mansions were events of some kind. This one looks like a more focused solitary-ish effort. Every year at Halloween, the forces of good mysteriously start to weaken. In a land called Ghostly Hollow, the Magikoopa Kamek appeared. Ooh, I like this music. Using his magic, Kamek threatened to turn all of the Mushroom Kingdom into ghosts. Oh my. Now Mario must enter Ghostly Hollow once more to face Kamek yet again! This is all automatic, but little did Mario know of the terrors that awaited him within. Anyway, everything that happened up to this point was automatic. Ooh, I am loving this map. Oh, whoops. There wasn't a name, so I didn't think that there would be a level here. No! Don't rerun. Um, whoops. So yeah, this is an automatic thing, I'm just tapping buttons to try and get through text boxes more quickly. But yeah, right off the bat I'm wowed by the aesthetics, I mean, it looks to me like this entire game takes place in a ghost house or a mansion of some kind. So first off, the entry hall. Oh, neat! Oh, wow, that's amazing! Look at that! Rex Bat! Rex Vampires and Rex Bats, that's so cool! I love it! Oh, instead of uh, Yoshi coins or Dragon coins or Ramen coins, they're Moon coins! Rex Bat! Oh, that ghost isn't uh, vulnerable to being pounced on by blocks. Alright, so. So. Bonk. More mushroom power. Yes. Second moon coin. Oh, wow. I'm loving the aesthetics of this place. Third moon coin. Nice. Now there's two paths I can take. Upper and lower. I think I'll start with the upper path. But I can't go back. Well, I guess I'm stuck with my choice. That which has been done cannot be undone. Ow! My face! My beautiful, wonderful face. Oh. Um. Okay then. Bonk. <laughs> Alright, well then. I guess I am uh, done here. I guess there wasn't that big a difference between going up and ooh, going down. Oh, look at those bats, they're amazing! Alright, can't go up there. I should check these pipes. Oh! One of these Goomba filled pipes does allow you to enter into it. I wouldn't think that it would do something like that, and yet it did! It did! Take that, bat! Alright, that's four moon coins. Alright, so. Hey, bat. Ah! 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 That's so uncool! Plonk. I love the background here. Yeah! Rex bats! 
Oh wow, I, I, uh, I thought I made a mistake there and I thought I was going to get hit, but no. No. Instead I freed myself. Oh, I mistimed my jump. Had I jumped a little earlier, I could have bounced off that Rex to... Well, that was a short level. Well, no, no, that level wasn't short. That level felt pretty long and stressful. Alright, up next, audience chamber. It is a chamber. It contains an audience. Help, Mario! Kamek's awful magic has turned us all into ghosts! Neat. Kamek locked the door to the upper levels of the mansion. You must find a way to reach him. Please defeat Kamek and destroy this place. Only then can we be free of this curse. All of my friends have turned to ghosts. Wait, I'm a ghost too? Oh no. Actually, I've heard there's an item in this mansion that can turn anyone or turn you into a ghost. But why would anyone want that? Well, I mean, if you're not a ground-bound ghost, you can fly all... Wait, that that's the end of the level? Let's try this again. Yes. Oh my. I've heard that these doors will open if you have enough stars. Try coming back when you have more. Let's see. Two. Four. I am scared that these ghosts can actually hurt me. What a horrible night to have a curse! Ah, oh, it's a perfect night for a curse. Ten and fourteen. Two, four, ten, and fourteen. Okay. Okay. Well then. I guess it's time to move on to the Grand Mezzanine. I keep hearing mezzanine when I'm at airports and I never bother to look up what a mezzanine is. So I still have no idea what a mezzanine is and it's all my fault. If I remember to look it up after this episode, I can just, you know, look it up. Yeah, that, that's the thing about the internet age. If you don't know something, it's your own fault. Well, if you have internet access. There are plenty of people who don't. Heck, oh no! Oh no! Should have done a spin jump to acquire that coin. A spin jump. So, as I say, oh yes, if you have internet access, it's your own fault when you don't know something. Especially something like mezzanine that I've been hearing for years and never bothered to look up. Power. And this time I know not to spin jump on that thwomp. Alright, so first moon coin. Hello, thwomp. Yes, I know better than to spin on your head. That thwomp is a trap! I just usually I just so casually spin jump on their heads that I don't even think about how they're situated. Thank goodness I was able to dodge it. Right, I need to normal jump up here and now I get out of here. Alright. We. Oh no. Oh, I was hoping to smack the block that that mini thwomp, thwimp, was on. But no. Alright. Alright. Woo! That was stressful. Oh my! Axes! I must have axes! Alright. Alright. How do I get up there? Alright, this level has to have an axe in it somewhere, right? Right? You wouldn't expect me to bring an axe from two levels ago. 
Ah, oh, I waited too long to make my jump. Curse you, ghost! And now it's not even there. The ghost isn't even there anymore. Ugh, I failed to make my normal jump. Let alone spin jump. I was, I was trying to make a long jump from up here. Like this. No! No. Alright. Bonk. Alright. Alright. Power. Now I need to be extremely careful because there's no way to hide the axe. There's no way to hide it up in my upper box. Yeesh. Okay. Okay. Now I can get that coin. Third moon coin. Alright. And now? Oh good, still a mushroom. Hey, Thwomp! Yeah! Take that, Thwomp. Oh, clever, hiding a Thwomp in behind that curtain. And relying on... Oh no. Oh no. My axe madness has prevented me from collecting... One of the coins. You want me to actually stop and think about what I'm doing instead of just destroying everything I can? What kind of video game is this? Well, at least I picked up uh, the, the final one, even if I missed one because of my own gone mad with power schemes. Alright, so... So... Th this block is suspicious to me, right here. Hiya! It's not a pipe. It's not a door. Well, not a door. It's not a pipe. <laughs> it doesn't have a door on it. The door under it is just for looks. So! Two stars. I'm going to go do a thing in the audience chamber. Because I have that capacity now. Alright, these ghosts are immune to my weapons. But yes, what's here? The lower floor of the mansion is ruled by the ghostly Big Boo. You're not afraid of him, are you, Mario? No, I am not. Now, if it were King Boo, who successfully kidnapped Mario in the past, sure. Mario, I've discovered a secret that might help you. Listen, Kamek locked the doorway leading to the upper floors of the mansion, but there might be another way in from the outside. Try looking in the gardens. Thank you. So, I guess this is sort of an information hub or something. Yes. So the first floor is ruled by a giant ghost monster. Oh, oh, I love those tiny ghosts on the map. That's amazing. The ghostly gallery. Oh my, an auto scroll level. All right. Oh, the, 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 the painting releases Shifo. That's amazing. Hiya. Alright. Ha. I cannot enter that door. No matter how hard I try. I love this gimmick of paintings of enemies unleashing that enemy. That's great. Alright. There's not a platform I can stand on there. And I just... I'm enjoying seeing these paintings. Yeah, this truly is a gal- HA! That's awesome! And then this painting of, a uh, Lakitu? Lakitu? Lakalulu? Drops the enemies that you expect a Lakitu to drop. Alright, so my guess is that that first segment was there to introduce 
the gimmicks of the level, and I'll be seeing those in various forms throughout. Right? Right? Ha! Ah, axes are awesome. Bonk. Bonk. Hello, Galoombas. Ooh, sliding time! Whoa, no! No, that's a terrible idea. Trying to use my just my love of sliding against me. Grr. All right. Well. Okay. Now we're starting to see. Oh, hey, look! Look at that! Ha ha! I hope I didn't need one of those bats for anything, because I could easily see having to ride one of those bats out. Are these ice blocks? They are! Oh, I can't go back. I messed up. I couldn't decide which direction I wanted to explore. Oh, nice. I see that, uh... Oh, no. Oh, no. Alright, that's four. Yeah, that painting of the fish, and then there are fish jumping at me. Oh, it's there's a reason it's only shooting to the right. Oh yeah, that was brilliant of me. Alright, coin number five. I'm not tall enough to acquire it. And I'm not willing to risk death to acquire it because it's only worth one fifth of a life. Okay. I know better than to change rooms early now. Oh! Oh, look at that! I love it. Well, the gallery was fun. Weird. Really fun. Fun because of its weirdness. Oh, the haunted halls. This must be where I fight a ghost boss in order to reach the gardens. Oh, I like this music. Even if I can never remember where it's from. Ha! Ah, take that, ghosts. Oh, this is a power up that I was warned about. Earlier. Oh, I, I like the. Uh... Come on, brain. Ooh, what's this? Anyway, I like the silhouette that uh, accompanies the, where the power-up will go. And I also love the... Uh, um, oh yes, I love the silhouettes that go places. Oh, oh yeah, I love the appearance of Mario's ghost form. That's great. So you can tell thing when things don't respawn because they don't have a silhouette. All right. Oh, now I have to actually. Oh my! I need to hurry and be careful at the same time. Yes, made it. I made it. All right, that's two. I don't know, did I miss a ton of content? I missed a ton of content. Unless all those doors from the first room just exist to send me back in time. Alright. Oh, hey. Hello, you. Okay. That happened. Alright, one, two, three. Extra life? What? That's just weird. 
Oh my. Ghosts every which way now. Oh no, I messed up. One, two. I am not sure how I managed that, but whatever. See, I like how this boss changes things up with each, uh, with each phase. Alright, so... I, oh, okay. I'm like, I've hypothetically won. Why is it taking so long to finish? And I was waiting tensely for another form to show up. But yeah, that boss changed something up every phase, rather than just having you do the same thing three times. And also there was the stress of running out of resources, especially once I started accidentally breaking things without uh, doing any damage. The Moonlight Gardens. So, in short, yes, that was a really good boss, and I'm glad to have experienced it. So, here are the gardens. Oh my, those flowers. Oh, I have four stars now. I can go back and learn more toad stuff. Crunch, 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 ball. Alright, so. I really enjoy the sounds of this here garden. Oh. Oh well. Wait, how did I pick up... How did I do that? How did that happen? I, I picked up a block from above my head. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know how I did that, but that is now a thing that I can do. So, as far as I can tell, that is accomplished by holding the run button and jumping between those blocks at precisely the right point, potentially with forward momentum, but I'm not entirely sure about that. Let's see if I... Nope. First I must crush you. Get back here so I can crush you. Oh my. Yes. So. What is the precise point that I need to jump at to do that? Oh, I am so good at this. Ha! Take that, you fire breathing plant monstrosity. What? What? I let go of the run button, but I also... Yeah, I let go of the run button when I jumped, and somehow letting go of the run button in the air cost me momentum. But whatever, I have axes now. Ha! Take that, let rest of the level design. Alright, so... Oh, green shy guys do not drop. I see. Oh. And so this is a, a segment where I need to weave back and forth along the level. Okay. Sure, I can handle that. Emotionally. Oh, that, oh. Four of the uh, moon coins are my... Why, why am I not playing well anymore? Hiya. Alright, you know, whatever. I, I'm going to stop messing around and try and do things similar to what was intended, except I have axes now, so, you know, I'm sure the axe was granted to me by the level, but, but, it just does so much more than I can without the axe. Oh, I think I made, I think I made it indoors. Yes, upper floor, indoors. Take that, Kamek. Your attempt at locking me out has failed. But first, I wish to return to here. 
and check out the four star door. I hear they have the best food in the mansion. I read there is a magical mirror somewhere in this mansion, Mario. Don't look into it! I've been looking for a spell to break the curse, but I haven't found any. If only I could find the secret library hidden somewhere in this place. It says here there's a hallway somewhere in the mansion that watches you. What does that mean? It means that there's a man, a hallway, and there are watches in it. There's a corridor on the second floor where time flows strangely. There's an elevator there that can take you higher. That Kevin, he does this every Halloween. Well, good thing every Halloween is only once every few thousand years, because that would get annoying if it happened every year. That would get annoying real fast. So, now I have made it inside the Corridor of Time. Did, did Kamek just steal a part of the Temple of Time and bring it here? Hello, clock that floats in the air. Oh, and there's clocks in the back. Good work, me! Anyway, clocks in the background, too. Alright, so... Oh. For a second there, I thought that ghost was jumping at me. Okay, I... Ugh. I thought I was going to get hit. Ah. I want what's in that block, but so many ghosts and I want to power up. Alright. Now, how do I get you to clump together in that? Yes! Haha, -ha, take that, ghost. Oh, I was supposed to use this to stop the ghosts and head over here. But instead, I headed over there in order to power up and then headed back. <clears throat> oh, this is solid. Yes, solid. Oh, oh. oh right, solid. Oh, phew. For a second there, I wasn't sure. Ah! No. Why me? Why? Okay. Okay. Oh, my. Here's the supposed elevator. Well, time to ascend, I guess. Hey, ghost. Oh. Oh. Oh, these coins exist to warn me about the future. Thank you, coins. That's very thoughtful of you. Alright, that's number three. Oh, but it looks like there's so much more I can ascend. The corridor of time. Why do you taunt me with all these clocks? Oh, for a second there I thought I had... Ooh. I thought I had re-entered a previous area. But no, it's just iterating upon the idea. Hiya! Alright. You really don't see clocks used very often in this game. It's cool when they do get used. Take that, ghost. Oh. Oh, no. I see what I'm supposed to do here. I'm supposed to... Clock puzzles! I could have gone higher. If I were, you know faster at dealing with clock puzzles, and better at placing the blocks for the clock puzzle. Oh wait, that's in the wrong place. Yes. Oh wait, I need... I need... Oh hey, that one is just stuck! Forever! Nice! So then... What I need to do is put this here, and then... <laughs> the door opened and closed way the heck far from me because I, uh, because of time weirdness. That was a 
fun level with a fun little gimmick. Alright, join me tomorrow for more of Mario's Mansion 4. It's it's really cool. Oh, tomorrow we'll fight another boss. How fun.